good afternoon happy sunday to all of your sunshiny faces so guys today is actually jack's birthday and um we didn't really do a whole lot honestly he just wanted to like play video games pretty much today um and we are not going out for his or we didn't go out for his birthday dinner because he wanted to go out next weekend i don't know why um and also well originally because of this weekend matthew had a volleyball tournament yesterday and then we were thinking that uh, matthew has to get his tux for prom and so my mom had originally was made an appointment to go um today and was trying to make an appointment to go today but then they never got back to her so um she um was trying to ask jack she was like oh well you know while we're in the area do you want to just like go there then for your birthday for dinner um and he was like no i don't want to go anywhere around there and like he's like i don't even know where he wants to go but he just like didn't want to go anywhere there so um it was like not even like that far away but he just was like no i don't want to go and like he was like let's just get something for dinner tonight and then go next weekend so we ended up getting augustinos um and then matthew also too had to work tonight so that was the other thing kind of like we couldn't have really gone out for like dinner tonight it had to have been more lunch and so that's why jack also wanted to go out for dinner um i think so um yeah anyways that's his birthday whatever he wanted to do um and so me and matthew gave him uh the birthday present that we both went in for um we ended up getting him last last weekend um i was actually gonna get him something else and then i asked matthew like oh could you take me one day this week to go to this one place where i was gonna get his present and then ended up actually when we were at Walmart um, in the we were just walking by Matthew's like oh look they have clearance games here and I was like oh they do and so I was looking and they ended up having um, the Lego Batman game for the Xbox One on clearance for like 12 bucks or 13 I think it was or something like that and so me and Matthew like both paid half of it and then I also too today while we were out shopping anyway got him Sour Patch Kids and so um I ended up getting it last week but he has it for the Wii so I think he's like played through it or whatever he's been on this like kick lately where he wants to get achievements and stuff like that so I thought since it was for the Xbox One and it's like a newer version of it and everything like that and he can also get achievements on that instead of he did can on his Wii um so that's why he was like we were thinking like he would like it and then also too because matthew was like he didn't know if he had the second one or the first one and so i was like do we chance it should we get it and matthew's like yeah let's just get it because if not like he's still been on this whole like you know like i said once to like do all the achievements and stuff like that so it wasn't that big of a deal we just went ahead and got that for him um last week and then gave it to him and then my dad is getting him a nintendo switch for chris or for his birthday this year um and so he is actually going to get it for him though next weekend um and i guess it's kind of like his birthday next weekend too because we're going out for his um dinner next week also but um yeah he like like i said just wanted to go out for augustinos and just want to play video games today so um we ended up going to the grocery store so this morning we went to walmart aldi and i had to just pick up my newspapers and menards um and so yeah we did all of our grocery shopping and everything like that and um i got everything on my list everything planned for we also got jack's cake which was actually like almost all of walmart's cakes oddly enough are almost always marked down for some reason it's like really weird like i'm not sure why we went to their like clearance section they actually had cupcakes there like they have their bakery clearance in the back and they had cupcakes there so we got that which actually when i read the receipt though they rang up at the regular price which i was kind of frustrated about but um they were only supposed to be 166 for like mini cupcakes and um they ended up coming up as like five something so it was a little frustrating <laughs> and so um but then we also we got him that and then we also got a small chocolate cake um and ended up uh getting that and that was i think like three something um for like a smaller size chocolate cake and so um it was normally like i said that one was probably also close to like six bucks it was like half off 
Um, and that was just in the regular, like, bakery section. But I don't know why, too. It was, like, almost all of their bakery stuff this week. Like, their cakes and everything like that were almost all marked down, like, half price. Um, and so I was, like, I don't know why. Like, I was thinking, like, are they, like, older? Like, they made them a while ago and now they just marked them down or something like that. Or, like, what it was. But, like, almost all of the cakes were seriously marked down. So... Um, yeah, I was, <laughs> I have no clue why, but the other thing too, guys, my light in here has been without light bulbs for probably about, well, two of them have been out for like maybe about a week now and I replaced them. I don't know if you guys can really tell, you probably can in the video, but I replaced them with this shining, um, <laughs> light up here, which actually is um because they're led lights and they're daylight daylight light bulbs um they actually don't weird i don't know why they don't leave a reflection because the chandelier the crystals it doesn't leave any type of reflection or anything like that on the walls from the crystals whereas when i had the other ones um they were just like regular i don't know not led lights um and not daylight lights they were just like soft white or whatever and they would leave reflections and so if somebody was like moving you know jumping upstairs if i ended up like bumping into the light because it's low um or you know something like that or for whatever reason the the crystals shake and they shimmer across the walls which i thought always thought was kind of cool but sometimes if you're not expecting it it gets like you're like what's going on um and so yeah but now that i have those ones in they don't cast a reflection at all it's very bright in here and it takes a i, I honestly think it's going to take me a little bit to get used to it because I originally was like oh it'll be good because like I like the daylight ones and it does actually it lights up like the whole room and they're very bright but um it's like I don't know how to describe it like almost like that LED kind of like shine to them but it's weird though because like I said though it feels very much like like it, I think it's just a little too bright like I maybe should have I think they're 40 watt light bulbs which is what I had in there maybe I should have the next lowest wattage though was 15 I'm wondering if I actually should have gone with that because I feel like that would dull it down just a little bit and they said they're dimmable but they don't dim which is kind of weird um because I have a dimmer switch in my room and so I was trying to use it. I was like oh maybe if I dim it down a little bit and they said they were dimmable but they don't dim so I was really um weird about that too but anyways though yeah we got those they were I think they're GE light bulbs though and unfortunately well not unfortunately they have a really long life the eco-friendly ones so they have like a really long life which is good but on the other hand like I said I was thinking I was like I should have gotten one maybe with just a little bit less um, cause it is a little bright, but I honestly think though, after a little bit of time, um, I'll adjust to them because our other light in the kitchen is like a, it has LED lights in it also, and it actually makes it look like there's a skylight in the kitchen, which is really cool. And so that's kind of how it feels like, like it feels like day light in here, which is obviously what the light bulbs are called, but, um, like that one for the longest time took me a really long time to like get adjusted to it. Um, and so I think it'll just take a little bit of time, like I said, um, because I'm not used to it being like so bright right now, but I do, like I said, you can kind of see there is like a kind of shadows over here and I'm sure the camera actually picks it up a little bit more, but for the most part, there isn't that like crystally kind of look to it anymore. So hopefully though, because I noticed sometimes with LED lights that cameras pick up like a little bit of a weird, like kind of, um, I don't know what to call it, but they pick up stuff a little bit weird, but hopefully these um, will actually make it a little bit brighter. And hopefully I'm thinking more natural light or look more natural because with the like tinty yellow color, I noticed that in my videos a lot. They're like a tinty yellow. Um, and that's because of the, the light bulbs that I was using. And obviously, like I said, hopefully if these don't bother me too much and they're not super bright or anything like that, obviously I don't sleep with my light on or anything, but, um, you know, like in the afternoons when I'm in here, cause I almost never have my light on during the day unless it's super cloudy out. I'll like always have my windows open, um, or my blinds open and stuff like that during the day. I love natural light. So I do kind of like this, but it's, I think it's just because my lamp is so low. It caught, 
catches me like catches my eye so much more and maybe like a wattage or something like that a little bit less um because they are very bright and like i said like when i was at my computer though i didn't really notice it because i wasn't and i didn't even, i don't even really need my desk light on because like i said it's so bright um but yeah i don't know it's just maybe take a little bit of getting used to but I did get some dishes done for today and I did make two freezer dinners. I made the ravioli freezer dinners and then I also made my personal size for ravioli freezer dinners which I'll have to show you guys tomorrow because they're the stinking cutest things ever. Um, and it actually fits perfectly. I was kind of freaking out that like I was going to have like extras or they weren't going to fit well. Um, but I ended up fitting about a serving size into each of those little mini um, loaf pan containers. Um, the little like aluminum foil tins and they worked perfectly for the amount that I bought anyway. So I was pretty happy about that. So I will show you guys that though in tomorrow's vlog. But um, I'm going to take a shower and head to bed. It is still early, so that's good. But I will see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog. If you guys did enjoy today's, make sure you guys give a little thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love if you'd subscribe. And I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow. So bye, guys.